Hey guys, Shane with OBQs, creators of the DigiQ once again. So, we've already installed our DigiQ, as you would have seen in a previous video. Now what do you do? Well, this is the best part. You take a pool cue, or a snooker cue, and you put the DigiQ on the end. So, I have my OBQ here. I'm going to simply take the DigiQ. I'm going to slide it over the end, and that's it. You want to make sure that when you push the DigiQ, you push it all the way up. Make sure that the, the, the DigiQ is flush with your rubber bumper. You don't want to leave a space. You want it to be pressed all the way up against it. And that's it. You're going to go ahead and turn it on, and you're going to play. Uh, in the next video, we're going to go ahead and talk about the, the different settings, how you change them, and what your goal is with the DigiQ. Uh, when you are done and you want to take it off your cue, just pull it. You don't have to be too concerned, well, really concerned at all, with it being on too tight. Sometimes if the, the butt of the cue is a little thicker, OBQs traditionally are a little bit skinnier. If it's your, the butt of your cue is a little thicker, when you go to pull it off, you may feel like it's really hard to come off and you don't want to rip it. Well, you're not going to rip it. This silicone rubber is extremely uh, strong and very stretchy. So you can just pull and just pull as hard as you can and it'll come right off and you're not going to damage it. And that's it. That's how to uh, put the DigiQ on and off of a uh, cue. We'll uh, talk to you in the next video about how to change settings and what your goal is for the DigiQ. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.